Good morning everyone, Newborn Investor here and welcome back to another live day trading video. Hopefully we get some great opportunities today as we're all here to make some money. But before we get into today's video, if you really appreciate what I do here, show me some support by hitting the like and subscribe button. It means a lot. That being said, let's get straight into today's action. Pre-market doesn't look good. Triple Q on a downtrend, even though it's capping up. Nvidia, Amazon and Tesla all following the same. Clearly on a downtrend. At market open, I would like these stocks to make a move to the upside and then fail, giving me an upper wick, which would give me confidence to short or buy puts. Amazon flushing now. Nvidia and Tesla holding, but clearly on a downtrend. At market open, I'll wait to see how these stocks react and then define my trades based on that. We do have around four minutes to market open, so I'll go ahead and pause for now and I'll talk to you guys at market open. Market is open, watching Tesla and Nvidia. Nvidia flushing, Tesla holding out. See how quickly Nvidia is reversing. No trades as of yet. Waiting. Five sixty five. Yep, I'm in. Stop would be high of the scandal. out of two contracts, holding the remaining. Out. I did not like how it was trying to come back. That was a clear trade, making $50. I'll take it. Around two minutes for the scandal to close, not in a hurry to jump in. Five ninety five. I got in. That was an impulsive trade. Holding three contracts. Just holding one out. Impulsive trade, not a great trade, nothing to boast about. Amazon looks good, but Amazon's options doesn't have enough volume and open interest to get me interested. That's why I'm skipping Amazon. And now speaking about Tesla, it's clearly hesitating to drop below Friday's closing price. That suggests a reversal and the candlesticks doesn't look good. We have upper and lower wicks. Looks like things have slowed down. Tesla never gave me a good setup after my second trade. So I think I'll wrap it up for today. Overall, a great day of trading, making $75 in 30 minutes. I have no reasons to complain. As I always say, my goal here is not to hit home runs, but to make consistent basics and live another day to trade. 
I'll talk to you guys in my next video. Until then, stay safe and thanks for watching. Bye.